Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Shemaine and I do lipstick swatches. If you are new here, welcome to the lipstick swatch family. If you have been with me, I thank you for your continued support. Today's video is gonna be about Too Faced. So I picked up this cute little set on Sephora. It is the Too Faced Sex on the Peach Deluxe Lipstick and Balm Set. So if you have been looking to get into Too Faced or try um, any of their products, this is a great way to get introduced to their products. So this lipstick um, called Sex and the Peach, apparently it's one of their best selling lipstick shades and I have heard about it. I have never owned it. So um, I thought, hmm, this is my chance to actually see what this lipstick is all about. So this is the size of the lipstick. Uh, does it say what the ounce is? I don't see it here. So it's actually one gram, 0 0.03 ounces. Nice package, cream package with your Too Faced um, logo on the top of the lipstick there. And that's how much lipstick you get. 0 0.03 ounces. Mm. From here to here, my pinky, it's a little bit less than that. So just a tad bit of lipstick you get. But it's a mini, so you really can't expect much from that. So this is a great way to, to try it out. And this is looking like a nudish brown. Oh my gosh, it smells good. Wow. It smells like a dessert buffet. It smells like strawberries and cake and marshmallows. It just smells delicious. So I'm gonna go ahead and give you guys the hand swatch. Well, you know what? That is not actually bad. Wow. But it is like a nudish brown peach. It's like a mixture of some beautiful nude colors, I would say. Anyways, let's get this on the lips. Like I said, I've never owned this color. Um, as a matter of fact, I don't own a lot of lipsticks from Too Faced just because they are out of my price range. So, um, this is my chance to actually test it out. Formula is creamy. Well, I have to say, this color is gorgeous, gorgeous. Oh my God, I just have no words. This color is gorgeous. It just looks like it's an effortless, I'm trying to find ways to describe this color. It's an effortless nude lipstick the formula is super creamy and is it a matte so it does come off just a little bit if you can see it comes off a little bit but the nude is such a flattering nude lipstick that i do not Thing. I don't even need a lip liner to wear with this lipstick. It's such a flattering color. 
what I notice is that it's not too nude. It's not too peachy or it's not too brown. It's just like a perfect blend of different nude colors. And it's just so amazing the way it swatches. It's subtle, it's sexy, it's cute. You can wear it to your nine to five. You can wear it out in the town with your girlfriends after work. You can wear it in a formal setting, in an informal setting. You can wear it at home to read your book. You can wear it to garden. It's just like a universally, <laughs> it's just like a universal lipstick that you can pretty much wear anywhere. You can wear it to the club and then you can wear it to court after you get a speeding ticket. It's like the universal lipstick. I love this color and I will definitely get this in a full size because I can see it'll be worth it. It's so complimentary. It's not too much. It's not loud. It's it's just perfect. It's like the perfect nude lipstick that you can pretty much wear anywhere with any outfit. I give this two thumbs up. This is definitely a winner for me. If you guys are loving this lipstick, go ahead and give me a thumbs up because this one is staying in my stash. I love it. It's just so gorgeous in every way. The color, the way it just flatters my my natural lips, it's not even doing too much. I don't even have to wear a lip liner or anything. It's just naturally flattering and that's so impressive to me. Like they just, they got this shade down right. I love when I find a shade that I really don't have to do anything. I don't have to wear another lipstick. I don't have to wear a lip liner. You can just apply and walk out the door. This is that lipstick. This is the lipstick. If there's one lipstick shade that you need at all times, I would say it's this lipstick. This is doing it. I can definitely see why people love this lipstick, why they favorited this lipstick, and why there's a cult following for this lipstick. It's I am one of those followers now. This is gonna stay on my list for sure. So next up from the set, we have the Deluxe Peach Lip Balm. It comes in this cute, little package here, little tub. And when I open it, smells very peachy. I expected nothing less. <laughs> so it may not appear pink on your screen, but it's actually pink. And I love a good lip balm, especially um, before I wear any sort of liquid lip, I make sure I put a lip balm on so I can never have too many. And we know how it goes with lip balms. We pretty much have one everywhere in our cars, in our desk, in our purse, um, on our nightstand. We need them everywhere because that's how necessary they are. So this is a mega moisture lip balm, 0.16 fluid ounces smells very peachy we're you know sticking with the theme here so that's good and i'm just gonna try this out after i tried that lipstick and ooh, uh, you know what this doesn't feel oily some lip balms feel oily and heavy and sometimes even sticky but I do not get that from this lip balm at all this actually feels really good on my lips it's not greasy 
It's not oily. Wow. I just wish it wasn't like, you know, one where you have to put your fingers in. I wish it was like a tube. That's like my only critique. But the tub is cute. I just wish it was a tube so I don't have to, you know, get germs in it from my hands. So you have to make sure that your hands are clean when you put your fingers in your lip balm because you can get germs and bacteria in there. This is one of the best feeling lip balms ever. It smells so good. Yeah, it's not it's not greasy at all. It's not sticky or anything. The formula is so different and unique. And let me see if I can give you a hand swatch of it. You probably won't be able to see it, but it is yeah, it's not really showing which I expected but it does feel and smells good and I like that it's not sticky mm -hmm. my hair doesn't even stick to it this is great I really like how that feels this is just this is just the great formula I never would have guessed that this felt so good and is this necessary? I would say not. I mean, if you buy the set, I would say it's worth it. But for me to go out and just buy the lip balm, I would probably or more than likely not do that because um, I have plenty of other lip balms and I can get them for cheaper. But when you think about the quality, I think this definitely separates itself from like a drugstore lip balm. Um, the quality is just different and it has me looking at it differently and making me think if I would actually invest my money in this and I would because it it feels like no other lip balm um, that I've worn. If anything, I'm trying to compare. Bite Beauty's lip balms are good, Laneige, those are good um, and I, I have a few others but this is definitely on the top I would definitely put this one on the top of that list the formula for this is just as it feels very luxurious it doesn't feel like a cheap lip balm that you would have to reapply like every five minutes and or sometimes it even does leave your lips feeling more chapped so I feel like this would last a long time. It definitely feels different and different in a good way. So if you ask me if I would invest in this lip balm, I would say yes. But this lipstick is definitely a winner for me. You can wear this lipstick literally anywhere from work to the club to court than to church. Maybe not in that order, but you can definitely wear it to all four places. So I think this is a great set for you to invest in for yourself or for a gift for a makeup lover or anyone in your life that would be interested in something like this. I definitely give this a thumbs up. I love this set. I am so glad that I purchased it. And now you guys know what my opinion is on this set. So it's up to you now if you feel like you would want to get it or not, but I definitely personally like it. If you guys like this video, make sure to go ahead and give me a big thumbs up. And also don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell because that's the only way guys that you're gonna know when I post a video. I wanna thank you guys so much for watching and I will catch you in my next lipstick swatch video. Bye.